Boxing Ego here. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon on the top of your screen to get notified when the latest new content drops. One. I want you to do me a favor. Yeah, sure. I want you to hit me as hard as you can. What? what? I want you to hit me as hard as you can. Eagles Fight Club. Fight Club. I want you to hit me as hard as you can. What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel for the latest and greatest in boxing if you want to become part of the gang gang notification gang. Please hit the bell icon. Shout out to the super chats, channel donations, the Venmo donations, and the Patreon family. We working. Ego Durden returns. Adonis Stevenson versus Badu Jack. Let's hear it. Drop your official fight predictions. Not only what happens, how it happens. I want to hear detailed predictions. Great, meaningful fight at the light heavyweight division. I'm looking forward to it. Shout out to Showtime, Floyd Mayweather, Mayweather Promotions, and everybody involved. Shout out to Canada. It's a good fight. Some people have complained about Adonis Stevenson's title reign and says he hasn't fought the Kovalevs and Andre Ward when he was active. Things like that, guys that they felt would have been on the level. Instead, he chose to fight Thomas Top Dog Williams, guys like that he already beat, like Andres from Far, stuff like that. This is a certified test. Badu Jack to me, he has an incredible boxing story. Cinderella man, if you will. He tasted an early defeat, and people thought he wouldn't be the same. And he proved the doubters wrong by not only facing champions, but facing the champions and defeating them. You know what I mean? Or former champions. Former champ like George Groves. He, in my opinion, beat James DeGale, even though they said it was a draw. I think he really won that fight. And also guys like Anthony Durrell for the WBC title. These are all great fights at 168. Then he moves up and he has a fight at 175. New division. First fight at that. No tune-ups. He's fighting Nathan Cleverly, who was a champion at that time. Even though he had lost earlier to Kovalev, he had become a champion again. And... He moved up, stopped Nathan Cleverly, and now his second fight in the division at light heavyweight, he's taking on Adonis Stevenson. And no matter what you think of Adonis Stevenson's choice in title defense, fighting Saki Obika, someone that Andre Ward beat years prior to Adonis Stevenson beating him, Tavoris Cloud after Bernard Hopkins beat him, you can't deny Adonis Stevenson is a good fighter, and his left, his left hand is lethal and very deadly. So... I'm looking forward to a good fight, Ego Durden, Fight Club, first rule of Fight Club. You do not talk about Fight Club, the second rule of Fight Club. You do not talk about Fight Club. Drop your fight predictions, Adonis Stevenson versus Badu Jack. I can't wait. It's going down Saturday. They also have a split site uh, title defense against Gary Russell Jr. champion, WBC champion at featherweight versus Joseph Jojo Diaz. So Showtime putting in that work. You guys put in work in the comment section. Make sure you smash the like button as always. Hate, comment, and subscribe. Till next video is Ego signing it off. So if you enjoyed this video and want more content like this on the channel, you can show your appreciation by going to the PayPal donate button or the YouTube support button. And you can donate any amount that you feel is equivalent to the value of this video. Much more to come. Thank you guys for your support. Boxing Ego, the future of boxing.